Hello everybody and welcome back to the next episode of the Pokemon Fusion playthrough. That's right, I'm King Karius, and we're here in Lavender Town. So, the game doesn't progress much at this point. We're essentially going to go through the entire Pokemon Tower and see what kind of fusions we can find. Um, after that, we're going to go west and through on to Celadon. But until then, let's go ahead and get started. Now, in this house right here during the day, we can go ahead and get a... Oh, items are randomized. That's right. Um, yeah, so that was an opportunity for us to get a sunstone or a moonstone, but randomized items, not gonna happen. And let's look at the odd keystone. Okay. So now, once we defeat what is it, 108 Pokemon in battle? Um, we can go ahead and get a Spirit Tomb. But here's our rival fight. Let's go ahead and fight Knight. Regicarp. So he has a Regigigas Magikarp? Oh, great. It's got Slow Start. Sweet. Okay. Uh, yes. Oh. is now confused we beat it all right we we're getting through this battle pretty decent venados okay so now i'm gonna switch into natsu we're really kind of over leveled for this aren't we flame burst immediate kill Sweet, level 34. Level 30. Me Metageot? So this is a Metagross Pidgeot. That's insane. Okay, uh, well, Flame Burst takes care of it, no problem. That's a pretty cool Pokemon, I'm not gonna lie. Right, now it's a war... Okay, so now it's a war turtle um, Ivysaur. Venice Shock will take care of it, no problem, and we beat our rival. Now... Here we go, we beat him. Okay, now I get to the rest of the story. I believe this still continues with the canon... Oh, Canon. It's one of the biggest uh, Pokemon conspiracies of one of the only canon deaths for Pokemon in the entire series, at least for just for the games, um, that he didn't have five Pokemon like he did last time. He only had four. So last time we beat him, we must have killed one of his Pokemon. And in Lavender Town is why he goes there next is to bury that Pokemon. But now Team Rocket trying to steal the Master Ball away from the President of the Silco. So now we gotta go follow him. Yep. Okay, so you're definitely not supposed to get through there first. Let's go ahead and get over to Celadon. And then we can get the Sylph Scope. Because I'd rather not spend any time trying to bull rush through there when I know for a fact we can't get through. Now I gotta fight all these trainers. <sighs> Charduck. Okay, so there's a Charmander Psyduck. Psybeam. Done. Chin. Oh, this is a Chin Chow. It's one of the Sand Dial lines. I just know that. Yeah, I'm gonna die if I continue doing that. So let's go ahead. Go into Grave Trio. Uh, 
attack doesn't affect us. And we're gonna use Earth Power. Good there. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon real quick. I want to give Phantom a chance. And Grave Trio. Alright, Gambler Jasper sends out Pipish, so Piplup Oddish. So we are going to go with Psy Shock. Done. Alright, Slugby, okay. I think this is a Pokemon we've seen before. It's a Slugma Eevee. Psy Shock. Done. This guy. So our Pokemon don't really need leveled up too much. Beakwill. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I want this. This is a Beedrill Cyndaquil. That's so cool. I want one. I want one real bad. Okay, so this is a Cyndaquil coughing. Super effective. Duoit. Okay. So this is actually just an evolved version of what I have. Ooh, ow. Yeah, we're gonna go... We're gonna go into Natsu. Flame Burst. Oh, it has Flash Fire. Okay, so Venna Shock. Venna Shock still works. That's the way to Saffron. Okay. Um. Okay, so another Gambler. Slugmander. Okay, so a Slugma Charmander. Dragon Rage kills. It always does. Let's go into Grave Trio. Earth power. Done. Simple. Venatata. Okay, so Venonat or Tata. Still think we can go with Earth Power. It's alright, let's go Stealth Rock for the next Pokemon. meant to go over for Sucker Punch. Done. Ninu, so Ninkata... Ninkata Axew. Okay. And see? Stones dug in, they worked. For Earth Power, know that it's not very effective, so now we can go into Natsu. Flame burst. And it's gone. See, that's a Pokemon I wouldn't mind having. Okay, United is evolving. Okay, so it's an Ampharos Croconaw. Until it gets to level 36, and then it will be an Ampharos. Um. 
It looks good. I like it. Ooh, we get Thunder Punch. There we go. Okay. So now that we beat that guy, we're going down here through this tunnel. And this should bring us up to Celadon. Well, after we get through Route 7, of course. Yep, now we're here in Celadon. Okay. Now that we're in Celadon, okay, so now that we contacted Erica, now we gotta go down this way and join her. Here we go. We're now in the Celadon sewers. Hmm. I don't think I can catch Pokemon here, can I? Pig Turtle. Okay, so she has a one of the Pidgeys as a uh, part of the fusion with her um, Squirtle. I think it's a War Turtle now. Bar Tom and Unkit. Yeah, so it, this must be a Pidgey War Turtle. Or Pidgeotto War Turtle. But that person has a Farfetch Rotom and a unknown Mudkit. So we're going to flame burst the Far Tom. Nice, okay. Uh, we are also going to Psy Shock, yeah, the Unkip. Knocking it out. All right. And now we go back to Flame Bursting the Far Tom. Done. Sweet. Brave Trio leveled up. Berry. Yeah, a bunch of berries in the sewer doesn't sound sanitary at all. You know, if it wasn't over there, it must be over here. I'm gonna fight this Team Rocket guy. Ooh, okay, so that is a Flechinder Trap Inch and a Honchkrow Natu. Psy Shock U. ominous wind on us. That was scary. But we used Flame Burst and it worked. These two Team Rocket people right here. Okay. 
Oh, okay. So it is a Yanma Chin Chow and a Joltik Kulaba. Interesting. Actually, we will flame burst this Pokemon. Twister and we're good. I really do like that he she heals us after every battle. That's very nice. Ooh, a mag cargo. Am I able to catch this or no? Apparently not. United is evolving. So, as promised, we do have our Ampharos for Alligator. Interesting looking Pokemon. Okay. All right. We changed the layout from its evolution. Now we go, gotta go down here. Okay. I had to do a hard cut because I wanted to get through this part. Um,. But essentially what you had to do was get back up through to the top where you hit the PC where it said you can go ahead and lower or flood the uh, sewers with water. Um, so you go through the gate up. So this gate up is up right here, but once you get through the top, you can go through the other side and down. And that's when you get out through right up here with those ladders. You take the ladder down to that bottom level, take this ladder up, take this ladder up, go to the left, you go down, and then this ledge up here will have already been scooted over um, towards the top, right? Well, when the water isn't there and it's just empty where you can walk like it was before, all you gotta do is walk up up there, knock this down by walking over it like this. Once you do, the both of you will drop, and you go through, raise the water again, and then just do the route that I did now to get over here. Then you fight these Team Rocket members as you go. Ooh, okay. Uh, and is a, it's a Corsola Curlia with an Abra Eevee. Those are really cool. Those are both really, really, really cool. Especially the Abra Eevee. All right, we would be both of them. Okay. So now we gotta figure out how to get over there and knock that down. And now we can go ahead and drain the water. Go over here. And they're getting mad. Okay, Prime Pup and Tardo. Okay. So this is a Primate Primplup and a Tyro Rampardos. Not not bad, honestly. Not bad at all. Prime Pup is gone. Sweet. Alright. Slash so shock to Tyrados. Except never got to move. It's all good. So it happens just like that. So whenever you walk up to one of those, you fall off a ledge. Ooh, another berry. 
Again, it's not the most sanitary thing to just pick up a whole bunch of berries in the sewers. Don't ever put yourself in a situation when you're in the sewers, but if you do and you see berries in there, do not pick them up. Got a charcoal, nice. Let me actually outfit my Pokemon with some items. We gave him a few items. Super potion from there. Now we can go back over to this side and get through. And then we go fight these two up here. One at a time? Okay. Ooh, okay. Trap B and Pinsor. So. That is a Trap Inch Krabby and a probably a Pidgeotto v, uh, Ivysaur. So I'm going to Flame Burst the Pidsaur first. Or not. Uh, get taken out by Crunch. Let's go with United. Why don't we go Electro Ball to Pidsaur? Alright, Twister took out the rest of its health. Natsu's evolving, let's go! Oh, it's gonna be the Charizard version of it. I'm so excited, I can't wait. Okay! Wing attack, okay. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get rid of Double Kick. Or we can learn Dragon Rage. Alright. Let's go ahead and put that on the layout. Alright. Now that we have our Charizard Nidorino. Alright, now let's go through here. Okay, I always go to the right, so now she's gonna go to the left. Let's meet up at the end. All right, so now she can no longer heal our Pokemon. Let's go ahead and try to get through these arrow puzzles. Yeah, now there's no choice, we have to fight him. Cutie. Okay, so it's a Cubone Goldeen. Oh, it have a red card. Okay. Uh, that's fine. We'll still go Sucker Punch and kill it. That's fine. Bulba. Uh, okay, so this is a Bulbasaur Unknown.
Okay. It's going to not to. What though it doesn't have any wings? Flame burst. Miss Molly. Okay. So this is a Miss Drevious Curlia. Wow, it took out a lot of my health. Okay. Let's go into United. I say. Thunder Punch. Good. Alright. Took it out. I thought there was a box that we couldn't touch. Okay, well now that I know how to actually use these things, let's go ahead and get through here. That's gonna make me go over there, isn't it? Almost sect. So this is a almost star hero sect. On palm, Bonsley a palm. Nice. Not very effective, but it did hold up its red card, so we do get a chance for a free switch out. power. Zoo Vesta, this is a Zubat Larvesta. Gone. We went after Larvesta's typing by using Earth Power against a Fire type. Get through there and get that. Rare bones are worth money. Well, we got a rocky helmet. Let's go through here. Gotta fight this guy. Fur two. Okay, so this is a fur it not to. Um flame burst. Oh, that's confused, that's wonderful. Because it used Wish. Jeez. Well, at least it's... Yeah, it's gone now. Wish won't let it come back. Wow, this is the first time you could actually get past somebody that challenged you to a fight. Ooh, Delo Deliodile. So this is a Delibird Crocodile. Ah, Crunch killed us instantly. That was wonderful. Okay, let's go ahead and switch into Natsu. Venoshock. Okay, let's go. Alright, took it out. Alright. Oh, 
It's Giovanni. And I didn't heal. Rat Isle. Oh, well, this works. We have uh, Ice Fang. Ah, never mind. We died. Brave Trio. Okay. Let's go Stealth Rock first. Earth Power. Okay, Sucker Punch. We gotta keep going Earth Power, apparently. Uh, Bulldoze. And of course, use the Max Potion. And now his Pokemon's unstoppable. Unless we can possibly put him to sleep? That'd be nice. Uh, I can only hope that he flinches. Yeah, because at this point, I gotta quickly get a one shot off right here in order to not die. Okay. Cool. Nope. All right. <sighs> Gabite Arcanine. Of course, uses extreme speed. Yeah, I'm not making it through this fight. Let me use a potion. nothing I can do. Nothing I can do. <sighs> okay, I have made it all the way back here. When I was first taken out of the fight, when I first lost, it took me all the way back to Lavender Town. So I had to make my way all the way back to Celadon and all the way back up the sewers. So now I'm here gonna fight Giovanni again and this time I have Charizard in Arena in the front with Dragon Rage so that's all I'm gonna use is Dragon Rage and try to take out these Pokemon as much as I can. Although we're gonna see if a Flame Burst will do more. Small swipe, okay. Dragon Rage took it out. All right. Yeah, by Arcanine, man. That's so sick. Uh, I should have definitely bought more healing items. Let's go with United. Ice Fang. Oh, it's frozen. Bought out? Okay. Mm. So what I was waiting for was paralyzed, but so suck us out. We're gonna go into gravel, uh, gravel trio. Because at least we're gonna go after the fire typing this time with earth power. Stream speed won't kill us, so we're good. Okay, so what does Pokemon does it have now? <laughs> I'm 
in danger. Dusclops, Soycoon. <sighs> Man. Okay. Uh. Shoot. Okay, I got a sucker punch. Let's see if that'll work. Come on. Let's go with Earth Power. We beat it. We beat Giovanni. Man. All right. Second time is a charm. Uh, that was a lot. Now that I have the silph scope, I can go all the way back up the tower now. So what I just read was that their triple fusion experiment is... Oh, wow, we made it out. All right, so their triple fusion experiment is fully operational. The three Pokemon that it's most likely better to experiment on are the three legendary birds. So that's Moltres, Articuno, and Zapdos. So I'm thinking their operation on Mount Moon is going to take those three Pokemon and try to fuse them together. Um, but now let's go ahead and go back to uh, Lavender Town and get back to the tower. All right, and we're back here in Lavender Town. Let's go ahead and get through the rest of the tower using the Sylph Scope. Oh, goodness. Okay, now they're just spirits of people. Cadaver Carp. Let's go with a Venishot. Here. Okay. And then we gotta fight the one. Fibrous. Okay, so this is a Vibrava Dunsparce. Wow. Okay. Um, let's go with United. Okay, so this is a uh, Rattata Slugma. Chinpoke, Chinchow Slowpoke. Item, I gotta go through her. Ooh, this is a Machoke Magby. Electro Ball. Okay. 
Gravel Trio. Grave Trio. Whatever his name is. Earth Hour. Goodbye. Do it. It says, give me blood. What is this game? So this is a Dratini Mew. That's really cool. Power gem. This is a Kofagrigus Sun Kern. the red. Now let's throw another fusion ball. What? Okay. Let's throw a Pokeball. It's in the red, so... One, two, three. There we go. I did look it up, and it is not a uh, bug in the system. It just really works that way. healed my Pokemon. Does that mean I get Charina back? Hearts. That's an Arceus Ralts? Nah. That, that is some cheating. Yeah, I'm going to a different Pokemon. Polo. Psychic. Alright, we took it out. Okay, jeez. That was super stressful. said give me your soul i think not madam it's a raichu spiro okay interesting pokemon um psychic it's like that
Okay. All right. I just know where I'm coming from. Okay. Kofa Mega. Ooh. Kofa Vrigus Yon Mega. That works for me. Venom Shock. Nice. This game just got creepier, even from like where Generation 1 was. Okay, so this is a Gyarados Duskull. That was my fault. Now we're about to fix it. There we go. It's all right. Just gonna go back really quick. Go heal up my Pokemon. Ooh, mud cool. Just one more, okay. Ooh, okay. Is an Azumarill Scyther. We're going to United. Okay, and then we are going to Thunder Punch. Your wind only does so much. We knock it out. No problem. Alright. There we go. Alright. Now up to Fuji. Alright, we got the Poke Flu. Alright, now that we made it out of the Pokemon Tower and back to the Lavender Town Pokemon Center, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here because next week we're going back to Celadon, we're going to go beat Erica, then we're going to go all the way back over and see exactly what our Snorlax encounter is going to be now that we've got the Poke Flu that we got from Mr. Fuji from Saving Him the Tower. So, we're going to go ahead and cut it here. Thank you so much for watching the episode. I really do appreciate it. If you did, in fact, like it, go ahead and hit that button down below. And if you want to see more, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I upload every Thursday. And with that, thank you. We'll see you all next week. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one. Peace out, fam.